I was short all my life. You know, every every time I played the game basketball, there was people taller than me. On the streets of Chicago, in eighth grade basketball, high school basketball, everybody was taller than me. You had to develop something to get past people because that is just that much physicality. Mm -hmm. And they could push you, they could steer you in the right, in a, in a direction where you didn't want to go. So you had to know how to get to, how to beat your man and keep him on your hip once you beat him so he wouldn't get back in front of you and make the layup either left hand or right hand. Mm -hmm. So as I was coming up and playing a lot of one-on-one, -on -one, a lot of one-on-one, -on -one, when I went to Texas El Paso, um, I developed this move, the killer crossover, and it just stuck with me. A good friend of mine, Isaiah Thomas, the Hall of Famer Isaiah yes. Thomas, he told me one time, you crossed him up so bad <laughs> <laughs> that he had to retire. No, 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 <laughs> he didn't have to retire. She, this is what happened. He came to pick me up and I went over to his house and ate penny pasta, <laughs> and I remember exactly what, what, what his oh, man, wife... Then you went and crossed yeah, him up. And, and, he was like, he said, and then he said, I don't expect for you to take it easy on me. <laughs> Hardaway backs off on top. Oh, oh, and he exploded it though. That was brilliant. I hope he's not thinking I'm gonna take it easy on him because he took me out to eat yeah. us to his house. He says, I'm just gonna dice you and slice you. And does he go for the move? Isaiah Thomas. But I, you know, I I I, I didn't I didn't cross him over that bad, but I, I crossed him <laughs> over a couple of times. But you know, it's 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 when you playing against a guy that you idolize, yeah. that you pattern your game after. Yeah. It was a privilege and an honor to go out there to play against him. He made me into who I was today. Well, um, I know you've retired now, but do you think, because I play in a men's league, I'm playing tonight. Oh, is that right? Yeah. Oh, wow, so, I need to go see that. <laughs> <laughs> well, I need to take a weapon, so maybe we can have a quick crash course. You can teach me how to do the crossover. Okay. And I'll, I can, I can and I'll try to bust it I, out tonight. I will show it to you real slow. I don't yep. do it real fast like I used to. <laughs> I do it kind of slow. All right. I'm going to teach you the basics of how you get it and how, you, how you're supposed to do it. So I'm coming down, all right? So I'm looking at your footwork. It'll be boom, boom. And then I'm shooting over Akeem Olajuwon. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. All right, well, let's see if I can uh, yeah, quickly learn this thing. Yes. Because i gotta, I got to bust it out with a few 40-year-olds tonight. So, oh, you know. <laughs> you're going to get somebody. So I'm coming at you. I'm looking for your feet. I'm going one way and then whew, Exactly. But I've got to go inside. You know, but you can shoot a jump shot yeah. too now. You can shoot jump shot. It's up to you. It's what, what's ever comfortable for yeah. you. Yeah. What was comfortable for me was when I crossed you over. Yeah. When I crossed you over, what was comfortable for me, I could get you on my hip. Yeah. And I go here. And if a big man was coming, yeah. I'd give to the big man, a uh, big man right here. Or I could throw it to the corner too yeah. for a three-point shot. Or I could throw it to that side on the weak side for a three-point shot to Deshaun Leonard or Dan Mark. Right. Well, uh, that's one weapon, the killer crossover. Now I've got another crossover for you. Okay. I'm going to get rid of this basketball. All right. You're in the heart of Melbourne, the heart of Australian right. rules football. Right. So we're going to get rid of this. Okay. And see how your see your, how your handles are with this ball. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So I can't. Like, no, you can't do that. Can't you can't do that. Okay, no, okay. no. What you have to do instead yep. is you have to call it's called a handball. Uh -huh. Right. So you put the ball like that, and then you just handball it. Handball. Yeah. You think you can do that? There you That's go. That's not bad. That's not bad That's not at bad. all. bad. Well, the other thing you have to do in football is you have to kick it. Okay. So it's like a punt. Okay. So you just have to line it up. Okay. Yeah. Let's see okay. how you do that. That's not bad. That's not, not bad, bad for a first That's time. That's not bad. Practice it a couple of times. I, yeah. I get it. Yeah. That's not bad. Tim, it's been awesome, man. Hey, thank Thanks you. so much for your time. Good. And I'm um, glad you're out here in Melbourne enjoying yourself. And, oh, no uh, question. No it's, question. It's great, it's great to have uh, the UTEP 2-step out here in Melbourne. All right, and good luck to you tonight. Thank you, thank you, thank you. <laughs>